Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNuts and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. Today, we're gonna do a few side quests and the first of those is uh, actually, well, started out by Sid, Vetra's sister. So uh, she contacted us through email that she thinks there's something fishy going on on the Nexus. So, uh, hello Sid, no long time no see. Well, two episodes ago, but... Good that you're here, Ryder. I found something while monitoring comms for the Nexus. Multiple attacks by people called the Three Sabers. They're hitting outposts and supply vessels. The really weird part is they seem aware of our operations, like they're getting intel. Remember kidnapped settlers. <laughs> okay, let's uh, not uh, start out with uh, a little stab, but uh, where's your proof? I hope you have some proof to back up that allegation. No real proof, just a pattern that shows they seem to know where to attack. And a feeling. I've reported it and they say they'll investigate, but then forget. But you're the Pathfinder. If someone's betraying the Nexus, you have to do something about it. Okay. Yeah, I think it's worth investigating. If they seem to know our operations, that could spell trouble. Best to get to the bottom of it. Thank you. I knew I could count on you. Best Pathfinder ever. Glad we can help hide, out, Sid. But I got the nav points for their most recent raids. Maybe the Tempest scanners can figure out where they went. Huh. Okay, investigate space attacks on Nexus ships. So that's probably not in here that we're gonna do that. So I'm gonna check out the quest log and check out for another check another quest out. So Captain Dunn, the captain of the Hyperion, the ship we uh, came to Andromeda with, so our Ark is asking for our help as well she is in a bit of a pickle and uh, well that's all the information i have at the moment so let's uh let's have a little chat with her and see what she wants from us sorry to call you in but this is best handled discreetly talk to me short version one of harry's med techs snuck a relative on board woke them up cut them loose turns out this relative has a rare illness not contagious yet, but in the later stages. Um, have you told Tan already? Does Tan know about this? What? No, absolutely not. Tan's office is an informational sieve. This gets out, we'll have a station-wide panic. Besides, this is a Hyperion matter. My responsibility. And this might become a station issue, but I'm Hyperion too. That makes it mine too, doesn't it, Captain? Thank you, Ryder. Please keep this to yourself for now. The only way this ends without major losses is if we handle things before the rumors get out. Right. I'll look into it. Good. Talk to Harry. He can brief you on the details. Let's bring this under control before it's too late. So, I need to talk to Harry in the cryo bay and, uh... Yeah, because that might be severely damaging. Out here. Thanks, though. Yes, you're busy. Nah, just caught up in my own thoughts. Got a lot of them. Okay. But I'll see you on the Tempest, huh? Sure thing, kid. <sighs> oh, they're getting along fine. Hey, Ryder. Taking a stroll? Something like that? I just wandered over from the Nexus myself. That place bores me. Too familiar? Been there, done that? You get me. I spent over a year stuck there. Well, when I wasn't exploring Eos. And I know things are getting better, more lively. But there are too many bad associations. I probably won't hang out there much. Fair enough, so thank you, PB. So let's have a little chat with Harry and see what we can find out about this uh, mysterious illness. And maybe it's not so bad as we think, so uh, let's take a look. A worker was lost to space during repairs on the Nexus Hall. The victim's name has been withheld until next of kin in the Milky Way is notified. Okay, that was really weird. The uh, the message you just heard in the uh, the metro was really weird. So someone, some of the one of the workers was vented out into space while working on the hull, but they won't give us his name until next of kin has been notified in the Milky Way. But what next of kin is he gonna have since we're six hundred years in the future? I'll make it from right where we started, so uh, yeah. I promise. Details probably. Hello, Harry. Good you're here. Done briefed you. Um, just a short version. 
High level only. Said to speak with you for the full brief. Great. Well then, here we go. Before we left, my medtech Charlie helped his aunt sign on to the initiative program. He cheated the screening process. Yeah. She has TH314. Deadly, highly contagious in the latter stages and jumps across species. It was dormant, but flared up when Charlie woke her. He just assumed it was stasis sickness. There's no cure, no vaccine. It's deadly in its final stage, and she's off-grid. She's a problem. Okay, she is a serious problem. Where's Charlie? Any idea where he's gone? Not long ago, he was assigned to an Apex unit for a mission. Incommunicado at the moment. Charlie had no idea the virus would flare up after stasis. Virology isn't his specialty. She's his only relative. Even so, he should have known better. Tell me more about the disease then, because we need all the information we can get. What should I know about this TH314? Stage 1 symptoms are similar to stasis sickness, which is what fooled Charlie. Stage 2 is marked by extreme bouts of paranoia. It becomes virulently contagious at stage 3. Airborne, but works. Is anyone else infected? No one so far. According to the test results I received after Charlie left, she's still in stage 1. If she progresses to stage 3, Ryder, it'll be bad. It's a rare disease, but the kind that starts pandemics. She is a serious problem then. We need to make sure she's brought in and no one else is infected. I want to put her well-being above all else, but we have to consider the implications. Making sure TH314 doesn't spread is the top priority, no matter what. This one isn't going to be easy. Anything else I need to know? Be quick, but discreet. We can't panic the entire station over this. I only have a whole space station to search. Discreetly. Check. Could be worse. She could be off station and potentially infecting the Angara. Try customs first. Even with fake medical clearance, she had to go through there like anyone else. Okay, Dr. so... Dr. has granted me access to Ruth Becker's profile. The file includes her physical description. That'll be useful. Thanks, Sam. Okay, don't, don't we get that? I mean, just to know how she looks? Okay, then. Immigration officer at the docking area. I would say isolate her, and if that doesn't work, we're gonna have to... Put her down, probably. If she can't be cured, then yeah, we just have a big problem. So we need to talk to a immigration officer. He's not an immigration officer, he's security. So cultural exchange, that sounds good. Uh, the dock manager, maybe? I stopped an unauthorized shipment to Kadara. Important stuff. Rations, tools, power cells, you name it. Corresponds with inventory discrepancies. Someone stealing and storing supplies around Nexus and Hyperion for delivery to the Exiles. If you could keep an eye out for suspicious or out of place packages, I'd appreciate it. I'll see what I can do. Okay, so Great. that's another Stolen supplies haven't been tiny side quest. Release, so Sam should be able to detect them. Okay. Um, not what we're do we're here for, but I found and something. Help your guards secure their weapons. I prefer them armed for now. You understand, of course. Okay. Oh, Pathfinder. Angara. This is the head of the Angaran delegation. The one who saved the Moshai. She speaks highly of you. Call me Issa de Navarre. W would I call you something else if that's your name? Um, yeah. Welcome, Ambassador. The Angara's first formal visit will be one for the history books. I wonder what they'll say. I was just explaining to the Ambassador that armed guards aren't necessary here. Is something wrong, Ambassador? Please walk with me, Pathfinder. Okay, we will. So much life. All different, all united. The way it could have been. 75 years ago, we were scattered, struggling to rebuild after the scourge. Then, the Ket arrived. Alien life. It was monumental. But then they deceived and enslaved us. So, I hope you understand my precautions. Um... Of 
Of course we do, but you know we're different. We came to explore, Ambassador, not conquer. And we have our own challenges. Yes. Which is why I'm here. I want to believe in this Alliance, Pathfinder. The Moshai says you're trustworthy. Please, help me trust in you. Um... We have much to offer. Everything you see, we're willing to share. Knowledge, technology, support. What's the price? Whatever you're willing to give. They'll surrender their weapons to your militia, if that's satisfactory. That was easy. Thank you. We won't disappoint you, Ambassador. Pavoa set Javta Ravon, Pathfinder. Welcome to Andromeda. Uh, why was the word Andromeda not in there then? Weird. Okay, immigration officer. Still looking for an immigration officer. Hey, Pathfinder. Um. He looks like Liam. Who are you? Uh, hi. <laughs> Gil Brody is your engineer, right? That's right. I'm Bailey. I used to work with him in the hangars here. You wouldn't happen to know if he's available, would you? Um, for what? I think as a partner. None of my business. I wouldn't know. Right. Okay, sorry to bother you. Just, uh, tell him I said hi, huh? Okay, that was not weird at all. Immigration staff! Yes, hello! Name? Sarah Ryder. Hi, welcome to the Nexus. Let me check the database and... Wait, you're already approved. And you're a Pathfinder. Uh, hi? Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for someone. Nope. Have you typing. seen Ruth Becker? Yes, I have. Why are you asking? Um, just a routine check-in. Harry just needs me to verify something with her. Nothing major. Oh, well, if Harry sent you, I guess that's okay. Now, let me see. How many Harrys yes, do you know? Ruth Becker tried to set me up with her nephew. It was cute. Anything else that you can remember? I restricted her access to the common area because there were problems with her file. I sorted things out, then messaged her to let her know she was clear. Thank you. Restricted access, huh? Sam, can you do anything with that? Yes. I believe I can help you retrace her steps, at least during that time. Pathfinder, okay. I've integrated Ruth Becker. Ruth Becker was here, Pathfinder. You can trace her with your scanner. Okay, so now my scanner can detect her previous presence. So over here... There we go. And then she was walking over here. She should be walking backwards, right? Or is this... Oh no, of course, yeah, because she's leaving from immigration to the commons area. Wait, 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 what did she say? She attempted to access the tram, but authorization was denied. Okay, I should be reading that. Okay, yeah, there she goes. Oh. Through this area, okay. Your scanner can pick up Ruth Becker's movements again. What's this? Oh yeah, the transfer goods. Supplies. I'll alert the dock manager. Free our families. Where did she go? She either went up. Clan before Or she went inside here. Your scanner oh. can pick up Ruth Becker's movements again. Through the area. Oh, there's a lot of people here. And she was over there. She received the following message. Finishing shorting... Finished sorting your form. Sorry for the wait. Come back to the immigration desk when ready. Pathfinder Rider. I need to know something. Is that the... Uh, That's your flag, everyone. Welcome the back. guy? Hi, my name's Sarah Ryder. Did you see or talk oh, to Ruth Becker? Oh, he's just a witness. Chance? Later, Val. You're looking for Ruthie. She was here earlier. Helped me sort out some paperwork. Don't know what I would have done without her. Um, where is she? Any idea where she might be? She mentioned checking in on a friend in arms. Taryn, I think. Is everything okay? Charlie's fine, right? It would destroy her if anything happened to him. Um, all good. Everything's fine. I just need to talk to her. All right then. Well, say hi to Ruthie for me when you see her. Have a good day. 
Because we you. don't want to stir any trouble, of course. So speak with Taron in Nexus Ops. So see you guys over there in a second. So, back in operations, Taron. Where is Taron? Is he all the way up there or is he somewhere over here? Nope. Right next to Addison's office, probably. There he is. Tyrone Aminus. Is that a woman? Hello, can I help you with anything? So her. Hi, my name's Ryder. You're Taryn, right? Yeah. What's going on? I'm looking for Ruth Becker. Was she here? She was here not long ago. She didn't look so good, though. Um, fresh out of stasis does that. She did just get unthawed. She's bound to be less than stellar. I don't think this was Stasis sickness. She was nervous, kept looking around. Uh oh, she about phase two. You safe. She ran off mid sentence. We were talking about the shuttles. Uh, maybe she went to the docks? I Check just came Thanks. from the docks. Jesus. Sam, paranoia defines stage two of TH314, right? Correct. The virus becomes highly contagious in stage Yeah. We kind of got that, so uh, highly contagious in stage 3. See you guys in the docking bay. So she tried to go back to uh, the immigration office here. Oh! Or, wait, Samuel Franker. We should really get medical to check you out. Can you tell me what happened here? I was here fixing a shuttle when this woman came out of nowhere. She whacked me over the head and took the shuttle. Nearly fried me taking off. Any idea where she went? Uh, I bet she didn't log a destination with control before blasting off. This is crazy. What's going on? Why would she do that? I'll find her. Don't worry. I'll bring her back. Good. Thank you. Anything else you can tell me? I blowtorched the hell out of the hole when she hit me. She'll leave her radiation trail a click wide. That's good. Very good. I can work with that. Thank you. So now we'll probably head back to the... Sam, our scanners can track the shuttle's yeah. emission trail, right? To the Tempest. Confirms. Look, we can contain a colony outbreak if need be, but... Ryder, have you seen Lexi? She's not in the med bay? No, and she's not answering her call. I'll find her. Okay, everything is going together here, so we need to get back on the Nexus to track Root's ship. And apparently there's something wrong with Lexi as well, so uh, let's get back to the Tempest. Okay, back in the Tempest. Hello. So let's take a look around... No, wait. Investigate the stolen shuttle's trail. I can do that from the galaxy map, probably. Turn it on. Thank you. So Radiation trail. I've set up our scanners to track it. Just say the words. Okay. Let's check it out then. What is here? Is that what's left of the shuttle? And it's just completely wrecked? This radiation trail matches the shuttle we're tracking. Okay. Expected readings based on engineer's account of damage to shuttle. Logging da data to facilitate tracking. There we go. There we go. More of the radiation trail. Seems radiation like it's just match. going. She went this way all right. Ooh, hull integrity degrading. So she might not survive this if we keep going like this. Pathfinder, scans confirm the damaged shuttle trail leads to a landing site on Kadara's surface. Oh, we're returning to Kadara again. So shuttle destruction imminent at this point. Ooh, that might be interesting. Because if all the people on Kadara start to go crazy. I'm gonna have a bit of a problem because those are all really aggressive people so uh, I'll see you guys at Kadara in a second so back on Kadara soil we uh, are headed towards where the shuttle might have crashed it's not uh, close by to where we have been already so that's why I uh, needed to take the Nomad on a bit of a trip of the shuttle, stolen by Ruth Becker. there we go because uh, it's actually right, a careful, pretty big map, stay Kadara. Stay away from Ruth when we find her. I'll handle this. Sam can make sure I'm safe, but you're all at risk. Stay away from Becker. Don't tell anyone. Yeah, yeah, I read the medical brief. Okay, take it easy, Drac. Just want to be careful. Um, that wasn't that's a the soft shuttle. landing. Not the worst I've seen. Signs that the occupant survived. Ruth Becker. <coughs> Shuttles crashed. 
I think I'm in stage three of TH314. The virus was dormant. I don't understand. <coughs> Can't let anyone near me. I'm going to set the warning buoys and rig the shuttle to blow. I'm scared. I'm alone, but I can't take the risk. I'm so sorry. I... Who's there? No. No, wait. Stay away from me. You can't. Shit. Somebody found her. Took her, maybe. That's not a good idea. Okay, then. Let's follow the tracks. Looks like Krogan. Over here. So, what does the, the analysis say? Angara. Okay, and then it suggests that they were carrying someone. Maybe I should take the Nomad. So Drac, Asari, and Krogan live much longer than the rest of the Milky Way species. Yeah, so? But now you've got about as much time left as Ryder, Vetra, everyone else on the team. If I'm lucky, get to the point. Must be weird. After so much time, finally facing the end. Time is time. Number of years don't matter as much as what you do with them. Whatever I've got left's gonna be chock full of living. That was an interesting conversation. So yeah, because Krogan and Asari live a lot longer than any anybody else. This way. Investigate the building. Are they gonna be angry on Gara? Probably because of the disease Judging if they're the here already. The beacon, I'm guessing they're not friendly. Um what do I do then? Just pick a sniper spot or what? Let's exit over here and check this out. So according to my sniper rifle, these are not hostiles, although I do get a red marker now. Let's pop a few of these guys. Okay, he's moving. Did they see me or what? This one isn't moving yet. What is he doing? What is that one doing? Hostiles ahead! Dicky blew up. Headshot. And then he died. There's one. There goes another headshot. Is that all there is? Seems like it. Rukar Raider, so there's another one. Hello, good sir. We are here to relieve you from your head. Seriously? So much there violence. we go. Anybody here? Ooh, shotgun heavy melee. No one here looks sick. Or they're just kind of attacky. There we go. Is there anybody else? Seems to be one downstairs. There he is. Remy's already taking care of business. Stop them. Level 21. They interfere. interfere with what? Oh, do they know? She's sick? Go. Thought there was one more left. That's the last of them. 
Unlock the door. That, so... Were they trying to actually get her sickness and weaponize it somehow? Yeah, what is it? Okay, there's wires running outside. This door, probably. There we go. Open up the door with the console. Let's check out the data pad. Everything is ready. All we need to do is capture more subjects from the Milky Way and expose them to our weapon before we return it to stasis. Just keep them locked up in the next room long enough for exposure to be confirmed and allow them to escape. They will return to their people and spread the disease for us. Be sure to keep the weapon restrained at all times. It keeps trying to kill itself to thwart our plans. Revenge will be ours. So yeah, that confirms my suspicion. All that he matches batch released to exiles upon banishment. Likely discarded once settled on Kadara and Rokar procured it for their own purposes. Okay, that's really, really evil of them to be using an uh, a paranoia a disease. Maybe we can use a pod to bring. Her the human is very sick, some sort of virus. From what I've managed to get out of her, it seems to have many stages. But best of all, it can affect any species from the Milky Way. But we and Gara are immune. We will keep her in stasis when not taking samples for further testing. Yeah, I checked that out already. The research is sound, Pathfinder. The Angara truly are immune to TH314. Interesting. Let Harry know when we get back. Maybe this will help with a cure or vaccine. Yeah, that might actually, because the Angara might be the Stay key back. to curing it. it. No, 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 I have TH314. I'm contagious. Don't come near me. Quiet. Human. Let me go or this one dies. Yeah, you kind of sound like the cat. I see an Angara. But all I hear is a cat. Quiet! You know nothing. Your people and the cat are all invaders. The Rokar will kill you all. You can't let him go. I think he has a sample of the virus. Just... just shoot him. You have a choice, human. Save this woman, or try to stop me. Sam, scan him. Does he have a sample of the virus? Affirmative. However, it is badly degraded. Possibly beyond use. Let Possibly. Me go. Now. Um. Fine, go. She stays. We could do that, and maybe we can pop him on the way out. You can go, but you put even a scratch on her, and you're dead. You're a fool, human. <laughs> Stay away, please. Stay away. I, I don't want to make you sick. Ruth, We're it's safe. okay. You can't infect me. But I'm in stage three. I know I am. I, I don't understand. I, how? It's complicated and we don't have time. Come on, let's get you back in the stasis pod. Finding a cure might take centuries. Charlie will be dead by then. We'll stuff Charlie in a pod too. It'll be fine. I, okay. I hadn't thought of that. Okay then. Thank you. There we go. Contagion Judy? complete. Let's take all that. There's a stasis pod here ready for pickup. Follow proper decontamination procedures. You found, found her. her. Is she okay? Okay, is there we go. Okay? Sometimes it takes a all really long up, time for dialogue to, to start up. Maybe we'll find a cure for her someday. I hope so. She's not yet wrapped up, but uh, I guess we'll have to take your word for it, Ryder. Success, the perfect weapon, one we can use to destroy all of the interlopers from the Milky Way, is now ours. They will dearly regret ever coming here. Axul will be proud of us all. So and yeah. the Rokar plan on using TH314 to kill off the Milky Way species here. Not a relief. This is going to be fun to explain to Harry. Well, uh, I'm guessing since the sample was badly degraded, he can't use it anymore. And... Uh, if it was a bigger event, I would think they would made this a bigger quest than it was right now. So, uh, but with that done, I'm going to take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And uh, well, I hope to see you next time. Goodbye. Hello, Remy.